Hi, I'm Kitty McNeil. I'm one of the district nurses for Fallbrook Union Elementary School District. A lot of people are talking about getting sick. It's not fun to be sick. You might cough or sneeze a lot. It might be hard to breathe. Sometimes you'll have a fever and you'll feel really tired. You could even have a stomach ache and need to go to the bathroom a lot. When you're sick, you can't do the things you normally do, like spend more time with your friends. Everyone gets sick from time to time. It's important to remember to use a tissue or the bend of your hand to cough or to sneeze. Don't sneeze or cough into your hands. Keeping your hands clean is the best way to keep your body clean. If you use a tissue, be sure to throw it away and wash your hands. Hi, I'm Pam Weikert. I'm one of the district nurses at Fallbrook Elementary School District. Germs that make us sick are everywhere. You can get, get sick from touching something with germs on it or from being near a person who is sick, especially if that person is coughing or sneezing. The custodians at your school are working really hard to keep your classroom clean, but there are things that you can do to keep yourself from getting sick. Wash your hands often and wash them well. You should wash your hands after using the bathroom, before you eat, after you cough or sneeze or blow your nose, and whenever your hands look dirty. Another thing you can do to keep yourself from getting sick is to keep your hands away from your eyes, your nose, and your mouth. We call that area the T-zone. Germs can get into your body through touching your eyes, nose, and mouth. Your body can fight germs better when you get plenty of rest. School-aged children need to sleep 9 to 12 hours a day, so don't stay up late. Your body also needs good food to fight off germs. Eat lots of fruits and vegetables and drink plenty of water. And take time to go outside and be active. Go outside and play at least 30 minutes every day. If you get sick at school, the nurse can help you. You might need to wear a mask to cover your mouth and nose until you can be picked up to go home. Your teacher cares about you. If you have any questions, talk to your family or your teacher. We all want you to be healthy so you can come to school ready to learn.